What is going on guys and welcome to another post-match review of AFC Bournemouth 2, Aston Villa 1. We've done it guys, we've reached the 40 point mark. I think we're on 41 points now. We're sitting comfortable in 11th position and we've more or less relegated Aston Villa. Now for me, that is massive because my girlfriend's father and family are Villa fans. So when we lost to them on the first game of the season... I'm sure you can imagine I got a lot of abuse. But now, we've basically relegated them so I can get my own back. But, it was a boring game to watch. Nothing really happened. And, quite frankly, I'm not too sure if we deserve the win. Probably a draw would have been, like, respectable for both clubs. However, we got the three points. The Villa fans obviously crazy and mad about everything to do with Villa. But that's for Villa fans to discuss and whatnot. Nothing for us to care about because at the end of the day, we won. We're staying in the Premier League for another year. And Callum Wilson returned from his knee injury. Fantastic, fantastic, fantastic day all over for Bournemouth fans. Now, I was kind of... I thought he was going to play today or at least be involved because he was he was training well in the week and I just had a feeling that he would fit into this game. Now, there's one negative about this game and I'm really, really disappointed is this game would have been perfect for a Turbe. Like, he is not getting the chance he deserves at Bournemouth. Now, I'm very, very sure... That we're not going to sign him on a permanent deal at the end of the season. I think he will return from us to Roma. And either stay there or leave Roma on a permanent deal to another club. But I don't think we're going to sign him. Because if he were, Eddie or Eddie Howe or Jason or whatever. Would have given him more time in the first team. That's the only downfall I thought today. With Villa's defence, I thought Gradle and Aturbe would absolutely wreck him. Now, Gradle had a poor game. And Lewis Graben had a poor game again. He is just not playing very well. I don't know what it is. Now, I am one of the players or people that think £8 million for Graben is an absolute rip-off. And he's done nothing since signing for us to justify why we paid £8 million. But, nonetheless, I'm not going to rant about Lewis Graben because I don't want to waste my breath. Today was all about the 2-1 victory and, of course, our man, Callum Wilson, back from injury. And, yeah... That is all for today. If you enjoyed the game, drop a like and subscribe if you're an AFC Bournemouth fan. And until next week, I will see you all either on Saturday or Sunday, depending on what happens. Because I'm going back to uni on the Friday. So, videos might be a little bit more hard for me to get uploaded. But, we're safe for another year at least. Take care. Adios and up the cherries.